See, so you're watching this video, I guess your computer is running with an issue here as you are trying to open a program I've recently installed. This is uh, the program can start because API MS Win CRT private L110.dll is missing from your computer. It's a very common issue, and all you need to do is watch this video till the end and follow that method on your computer. Hello everyone, welcome to Tech Evolution. In this very short video, I'll be fixing this error within 3 minutes. So, Let's begin. The first thing you need to do is open a favorite browser and search for the entire file name .dll. You can choose any result you want. I'm choosing the first one. And this is not sponsored, but I'll put the link in the description. I can see if you download option based on the architecture and version. To know your PC architecture and version, click on Start and Search for System Information. I can see mine is a 64 bit PC and I'm updated, so I'll be downloading that second one. I strongly recommend you to read this page, it has multiple fixing methods also. As the download completes, hit open. I can see two files one is a DLL, other one is readme. We need to place the DLL file. To move the DLL, first open this PC, then local Dixie, Windows, and find a folder name System32. This is the home of 32 bit DLLs. Then click on the downloaded G, drag the DLL, and drop. I have already done this, so they are asking me to replace. And click on continue to give administrator access. Let's check. By typing the file name, we can see the file is placed in the folder right now. So, job done for 32 bit, you can go and restart. Only if you are a 64 bit user, open this PC one more time, local DXC, Windows, and this time find a folder name sysfall64. And similarly, drag and drop. Check this one more time. Yeah, the file is properly placed in 64 bit folder too. And job is done. Now reset your computer. In extremely rare cases, if there are loggers, you need to download and install the latest Microsoft Visual C redistributable and install your program again. And that will surely do it. And that's all. If you follow me step by steps, you'll no longer have that problems left. Please let me know how you feel about this video. And do not forget to like and subscribe.